Hi friends, MJ and I are so excited to tell you about our theme this year in CBOQ Kids. Our theme is one, one God, one life. Uh, and we, it is all about cultivating intimacy with Christ and developing Christ-like character. And we're going to do that by exploring the spiritual disciplines or spiritual habits. And, um, you know, when we read in Mark, uh, Jesus was questioned, what is the greatest commandment? And he responded by saying, love the Lord your God with all your heart, soul, strength, and mind. And the second is like this, love your neighbor as yourself. These are the two greatest commandments. This is our theme verse this year, and we are going to explore what it means to love God and love others as we practice the spiritual disciplines. Now to hear a little bit more about what we're doing and how we're doing this theme, I'm going to turn it over to MJ. MJ is our content creator, and she's going to tell us about the resources that we have available for you this year. Uh, MJ. Yeah, thanks, Tanya. Uh, all of our information is going to be found on the website, but a cool thing that families can do is follow CBOQ Kids on Instagram. And twice a week, there will be posts specifically about one, which is really cool. The first one, which will happen on Mondays, is our mission training. And that is when you focus on a spiritual practice that's between you and God. On Thursdays, if you check in, you will find a mini mission, and that focuses on taking what you've gotten from God and sharing it out with others. And so that's almost a, a service-oriented kind of thing, and that's pretty fun too. One thing that you can also do as a family is you can make a time capsule, and it's pretty simple. Um, you can do it as simply as with a journal, or you can create an actual capsule. Some kids I love made me this box. Like that would be a good place to keep a time capsule and there's all kinds of other ideas on Pinterest if you follow us on Pinterest as well mm. so these are all ways that we can connect with God and with others so that we can really get to know God's heart thank you for sharing that I'm so excited and exactly. you know what there are other resources that are going to be available so you can check out our webpage, cboqkids.ca forward slash one, O-N-E. And every month on the first of the month, we will post that month's theme um, link. And so that will show you all the things that are happening that month. You're also going to see each month uh, something called a learning space. And what this is, this is specifically helpful for ministry leaders. There's going to be three components to that. And the first one is a little bit of more information and background on the particular discipline of that month. Uh, the second area is some simple ideas that you can share with parents, with families, ways that they can practice this as a family or learn to, to do this habit in their family. And then the third area is going to be with some teaching resources. So some ways if you wanna do some teaching, whether that's virtually or whether that's in person, uh, there'll be some ideas and some resources that you can make use of. And so we hope that this will be helpful for you uh, as we develop our theme this year, as we follow our theme that we've developed this year. Um, you know, our hope in this resource is that we can all learn together uh, ways of being, ways of life, that recognizes the presence of God in each moment. Uh, whether it's, it's good stuff happening, whether it's bad stuff happening, whether it's confusing things, that we can start to cultivate this, this habit, this way of life that acknowledges that God is present in the midst of it all. And, um, and that there are ways that we can grow in, in our relationship with God. And this is a great way to do that. Um, so I'm so excited for this year and I'm excited for all of you to join us on this journey of one as we blast off into these fun experiences. Um, just before we leave, uh, MJ, I wonder if you might pray for our families and for us as we explore this theme this year. Yeah, I'd be happy to. Let's pray. God, I am just so grateful that you have such a huge heart for families and kids and that your desire is that we would know you better. So God, through these next few months, as we try on different disciplines and different ways of speaking to you and reaching you, we pray that you would show yourselves to us, to our families, to our kids, so that we can all draw nearer to you. In your name we pray. Amen. Amen.